What's going on, Taurus? My bad. Don't do me like that. Welcome to your reading. I got messages for you. I don't know what's going to come out. We're going to just see what comes out for you, Taurus. These messages can or cannot resonate. Take what fit, leave the rest. So let's see what's going on with you, Taurus. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Okay. Let me see what you need to know. Okay. For my Taurus gang, what's popping, bull? Let's see what's going on, Taurus. We got a gift. So there's thoughts about giving a gift or somebody could be thinking about giving you a gift, Taurus. Okay. Somebody may want to be generous to you. Okay, this could be the father of your kids, but maybe there's no communication or maybe you feeling like, <clears throat> I don't know, maybe you feel like this is some bull. Yeah, I was going to say, you feel like this is some bullshit. <laughs> so, spirit guides, angels, and ancestors, protect me as I go into this reading the channel for a course. Any and all negative energy sent to me shall be returned to sender. We got, yeah, mm -hmm. somebody got that toxic love. <laughs> yeah. I feel like this individual may feel like you're somebody trying to trap someone into some type of like, I'm, I'm here like somebody may be obsessed with trying to trap you into some cage or something. Okay. Mm -mm. I see a lot of like watching going on. Let's see. Let's tap into the energy. Yeah, I'm seeing somebody want to come and give you a gift. Yeah, this could be a cancer or somebody wants uh, somebody wants a one night with you. Or they feel like they can have one night with you or something like that. Yeah, we got the moon. Okay, so something is very deceptive here. We got the king of cups. Yeah, so I feel like somebody's in love with you or... This person just, it's like they have these feelings for you here. They could be like going in and overanalyzing their feelings for you. We got 222. Two, two. Here, is some of y'all could be seeing 222. Two, two, so that lets me know that you're very balanced or whoever this is, they're very balanced here within their emotions. But I feel like this individual could be like escaping mentally. They're trying to plan ahead, but it's like they're overthinking here at the same time. They don't come off like they do, but... This is what they could be going through internally. The Taurus. What's the message for Taurus? Spirit guides, angels, and ancestors. We got the devil and the angel. So somebody's obsessed with this earth angel. Okay? Somebody's like obsessed for this person. They're yearning for... Okay, so I feel like somebody could be like obsessed with seeking some type of forgiveness or coming together here. Yeah, 313 on the clock. Somebody's obsessed with it. With seeking some type of... They have like a lot of anxiety or somebody feels stuck here. They're yearning for someone to be in union with someone or to balance something here. Or somebody's just like waiting on the perfect timing. Whoever this is. Yeah, I'm, I'm getting somebody's waiting on the perfect timing here. Yeah, we got the King of Swords here. So somebody could be lying about a love affair that I see that's going on here with the King of Swords in reverse underneath this lover. Somebody's lying about a love affair. Ah, let's see. Which one we gonna use? I'm gonna use this one. So this could be um this could be an emperor, this could be a Capricorn. Also, this could be an Aries and a Capricorn here that could have been lying about some type of love affair. Or this could be a Libra, Gemini, or an Aquarius that was lying about some type of love affair that's going on here as well. Somebody could have also been lying about um, being in a commitment with someone, in a long-term commitment with someone here towards. That's what I'm getting. Okay. Yeah. Reconciling here with the Six of Cups. Yeah. So somebody's a liar here. I'm getting this as King of Swords in reverse. Yep. Seven of Swords. So let's see what's this moon or something is coming to you. But I feel like with this with this gift here, this could be somebody like coming in to deceive you here with some type of gift or they want to. Something is going on behind the scenes. Something is an illusion or this gift will be some will be like an illusion. Yeah, we got the seven of swords, five of swords because somebody really hates the empress. Somebody really don't like you like that with the five of swords, seven of swords. So I feel like this could be an individual that's trying to steal from you or somebody sees that you're very, very much in this empress energy. What's this moon card here? 
Yeah, we got the judgment in reverse. What's the judgment in reverse? So malicious gossip behind the scenes. So it's like the only way that I could come in and deceive you and, and play with you here is if I come and give you this fake ass gift or some type of generosity or let me let you know that I appreciate you here. But at the same time, I've been maliciously gossiping about you behind the scenes here. Yeah. What's the judgment in reverse? Cancer Pisces energy. Yeah, we got the death card on trying to end something for you. So, yeah, but but it's all, like, quiet. Yeah, we got the Knight of Cups and we got the Strength card. So, somebody's, like, sending you something here. But this is supposed to shut you up, make you be quiet here. Or this is, like, a bribe for someone to send some type of gift to you here. Yeah, this could be the father of your kids. This could be um somebody with Aries placements, Gemini placements, um Leo, or fucking Cancer. What's, this, what's the Death card? Scorpio or, yeah, heavy Scorpio energy, Cancer, Pisces energy. What's the Death card? The will of fortune so somebody's like really like trying to change your fate or your destiny or whatever this is that you you're doing but something here is i feel like there's a big change here or somebody feels like this will be a big change here in regards to you what's the death with the, the will of fortune so somebody wants to end your destiny. Yeah, we got the seven of cups and they're confused why this doesn't work or. <sighs> this could be somebody that wants you to be confused about your path, your destiny here. I don't know. Maybe I don't know if you're confused about your path or your destiny here, but I, I feel like you shouldn't be. So I feel like this is someone literally coming in to disrupt your peace, to disrupt disrupt your equilibrium. All right. With the judgment in reverse, we got the death, the seven of cups and uh, the will of fortune. So I feel like somebody is confused as to how something has changed or how you switch something here. That's what I'm getting. They're like, well, how, how did how did Taurus switch this or how did you how did how did Taurus like, um, I don't know, two of cups, the page of wands and the seven of wands. We got the five of cups and then the magician, three of wands, because I feel like somebody has foresight or they were already to they were already able to see something closing here. I feel like there was an individual that didn't see. Or there was something that you've seen before somebody else did. What's the seven of cups? Yeah, the three of swords you've seen. Yeah, three of swords. You've seen the heartbreak before. I feel like you've seen like a three of swords situation coming. Yeah, the nine of wands. Now people are scared and shook that you did and you decided to make the right choice here with the two of wands. So. What's the, what's the seven of cups, three of swords? Yeah, the king of cups is coming out again. Scorpio energy. This person is heartbroken. Or they feeling some type of way and they're not trying to let you know that. Yeah, the nine of wands. They're not trying to let you know that they feel some type of way. Give me this king of wands. I mean, king of cups. Ace of swords. Yeah, the truth. Clarity. Give me the king of, king of cups, ace of swords. That was fast, man. We got the seven of swords. Yeah, so this person has clarity and they want to come clean. So I feel like whoever this is that's in your energy or around you i don't know if this is you or if this is whoever this this king of cups is but the king of cups came out twice already so i'm getting this person either wants to give you a gift or you want to give somebody something but with the seven of swords here somebody could have got caught in the act of doing something so now they may have to confess and come clean here this person's conscious could be come come um this person's conscious Whew. okay let me stop talking so fast this person's conscious could be kicking in now they're like contemplating here over something that they did. Fucked up. What's the seven of swords? Ace of swords. Yeah, the king of swords. I feel like they want to come and tell you some type of truth. Heavy Aquarius energy. All right. I feel like this individual could be trying to. I don't know. I'm just getting this person's getting some type of downloads here. They're trying to plan ahead as to how they can tell you this truth here. I feel like somebody really, really wants your forgiveness or, yeah, they're coming clean about some type of truth here with the King of Swords. This could be somebody that's a, um, 
And this could be about a, a, a judge, a military, uh, somebody probably, probably could be in a military year. That's what I'm seeing. Mm. 10 10 so maybe wanting to come clean and why as to why things have ended okay what's this king of swords seven yeah i'm seeing the page of wands so i feel like somebody's going to take it upon themselves to defend you or be on your side maybe this person is seeing the truth about you and now they want to defend you okay because i feel like there could be a lot of people trying to attack you or there's trolls here so i feel like somebody could be Whoever this is, they're in their head a lot because they didn't protect you. Yeah. What's this King of Swords? Yeah, the Two of Swords. Yeah, instead they blocked you out or this person could be stuck between a rock and a hard place if they should come clean to you. So this person could be going back and forth like, should I come, should I come clean to Taurus or I don't know or I don't know. Yeah, Six of Wands, the Ten of Pentacles, the Queen of Pentacles, the Eight of Pentacles. So, I feel like this person has a decision, like, because they made some type of pact with somebody else, and they're like, man, I don't even know. They're stuck. They're div they have divided loyalty, like, but I'm really loyal to this person, so I don't know if I should come and tell you the truth because I'm really loyal to somebody else. So if if I come and tell you the truth, then they will look at me as not loyal. Just tell the fucking truth, whoever you are. Two of Swords, yeah, it's the hangman. So they put themselves in a delay. And I feel like this person could be meeting up with people like, how should I come and tell you this or whatever with the Three of Pentacles? So I'm getting they want to come and give you a gift. And they think that this is all going to make up for what, what they did. What's the Two of Swords? Yeah, the Temperance. Temperance is out twice. The King of Cups is out twice. So you could be in Temperance, Nine of Pentacles energy, Earth Angel energy, vibe and high. I feel like you already know. This person is trying to wait for the perfect time to come and tell you or <clears throat> to reconcile. Or you could be dealing with a Sagittarius, Libra. I feel like somebody already been new about something from the past. That was a long time. So somebody has already gotten over something here and they have healed and they have required the, the, the balance that they needed to persevere and move forward. Because as I'm looking at this temperance, look at this, this light shine. Something was already illuminated in the past already with the temperance energy. You are already coming out balanced. I feel like you're coming out in this temperance energy. Okay. You already got your wings. You already, you know what I mean? You already balanced. You're already protected here. Somebody did not want you to be protected as well. But I feel like you have already been illuminated about something years ago. So I don't know who this who this is that finally wants to come and tell you something now, all of a sudden, after you already know what the fuck was going on. What's this temperance right here? King of Swords is out twice, but this King of Swords here, this person, they lied. I feel like you possibly have asked them, asked this person something about the past or what they did in the past. And they lied to you. What's the temperance? We got two cards. Yeah, we got the five of cups and we got the magician. So this person regrets trying to manipulate you or they're now they're feeling sad or they're missing you. Mm hmm. I feel like this person could have been trying to manipulate your feelings or emotional manipulation to make you feel bad for them, for you being in temperance energy. Who the fuck is this? Virgo, Gemini, we got Scorpio. Yeah, so somebody's like heavily trying to like control the way somebody feels. Like, no, like you're really sad about me. No, you you are. So this could be like sympathy spells to make you feel some type of way. What's the magician? And um, yeah, we got the moon. I feel like, yeah, the moon and the hierophant came out in reverse. I feel like you already know what this person is doing. They have no morals, no integrity, no knowledge, no nothing. I feel like this is a big secret here that's coming out. Yeah, we got the tower. So, yeah, this person likes to come and play on your emotions. They like to make you feel some type of way or they're trying to do some type of work here for you to be feeling ashamed of yourself or for you to feel bad or 
I feel like somebody wants you to be miserable and in, in some type of like grief or depression here. All because they want your energy. This person could be like a hypocrite as well with the Hierophant in reverse. This person is not a leader. I feel like this they could be getting exposed for not being a leader as well. Not conforming. Or maybe you're not conforming. Okay? And you just you just don't give a fuck. You're like, no, bring that whole motherfucking tower down. We don't care. What's the Hierophant in reverse with the moon? Somebody's getting exposed for, yep, sacrificing magic too here as well. That's what I'm seeing. Yeah, I'm getting whoever this is because this is the the devil. This is the devil energy too. So if somebody has been trying to sacrifice an angel here or whoever this reincarnated being deity is, okay, they've been trying to sacrifice this person, and I feel like the secret is coming out. This person will be exposed for not having any integrity, any morals here. I feel like this could be um, a whole group of people here that don't believe in God, but they come off like they do. It's like they're, they're enlightened about who God is, but they're so focused on being in this devilish energy here. Pleasure-seeking obsessions, toxicities, being tempted, feeling stuck with anxiety, longing, craving, bound, wishful thinking, yearning for someone. So I feel like this energy could be yearning for you. Whew. You could be dealing with a Pisces, a Taurus, Cancer, Pisces, yeah, Cancer, Virgo, Gemini, Scorpio, Sagittarius. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> yeah, but the 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 hangman, I feel like some of you guys may be pausing. You may be taking the time out to reflect here on what has been going on around you. Okay. Like what's been going on with your family or this could be, you could be thinking about releasing a lot of people here that don't have any morals or any integrity here. This is what you could be thinking about doing. You could be sacrificing um, or somebody here could be sacrificing some type of religious beliefs here. That's what I'm getting also. So you could be making this public or making this known like, yeah, you're, you're, you're sacrificing. The Maybe it just don't sit right with you. Because it's like how I'm picking up this energy where it's like, how is it that y'all believe in this and y'all still doing all this weird shit? That's what I'm getting. Like, how do y'all believe or how do y'all call yourself holier than thou when y'all doing all this weird shit? And I'm getting this could be people in your family here, Taurus, that's doing this wicked shit too. And these are the same people that be wanting to go to God. They be want they be going to church every goddamn Sunday. They go three times a week. They go to church on Sundays, Wednesdays, 18, 18 on the clock. Sundays, Wednesdays. They go to the to Wednesday night service. They go Wednesday in the AM. These are the same people that be going to do this wicked shit behind the scenes, behind closed doors. Yeah, so they don't have any intent, but they come off like, oh, I'm just, I'm temperance energy. No, if anybody don't believe in what I believe in, you're going to hell. Yeah. But they go to do this weird shit. What's, what's the King of Swords in reverse? Yeah, justice. This could be somebody that went to court or they made up some type of documents or something. I don't know why I said documents. <laughs> we got Libra energy here. We got the justice. Okay. Somebody could have been lying on a marriage or whatever. What's the justice with the King of Swords? I feel like somebody here is getting justice. Or maybe some what's what's justice, man? Two of Pentacles, yeah. So this could be like um somebody like hiding their money. Or they could be mismanaging their money, or somebody is trying to get stable. This could be someone that could be going to, um, I'm hearing like divorce court or child support or something like that. Somebody could be getting um, child support, but whoever this is, they're unstable. They can't even pay child support if they wanted to. Somebody could have lied and said that you put them on child support here, but you're very much in nine of pentacles energy. You're very stable. You don't need who, whoever this is. They make it seem like they give you money and they don't give you shit because they in the two. I'm trying to tell you, they don't give you nothing. They in the two of pentacles. 
they're like, oh, I've been giving Taurus money and I, this is why I'm in a two of pentacles, why I'm unstable here. Or somebody's been trying to manage something in the legal department. So this could have been somebody that lied on you and said that you had an affair with somebody and or whoever. Now they're trying to take you to court or something like that. They're trying to get you to, to pay out something large and big. What's the two of pentacles? I'm trying to tell you the emperor in reverse. This is a distorted masculine. They don't like you. Five of swords. And this is why this person's trying to play these little games. Get you involved in some type of legal um, legal fees or some type of um, legality, legalities that they're trying to get you involved in here, Taurus. It's like they want you to be blinded here so that way you can't see. So somebody's trying to put you in the middle of some bullshit. Yeah, we got an Aries here and um, we have a Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Heavy Libran. All because they don't like you. Five of Swords. What's this Emperor in reverse? This person abuses their power here as well. And it's like, this is supposed to be a leader, but they're distorted here. What's the Emperor in reverse? Yep, the Ten of Pentacles. This may be somebody in your family. The Ten of Pentacles came out sideways. I feel like this person is on the verge of losing something. What's the Ten of Pentacles sideways? The King of Wands in reverse, man. What's this King of Wands in reverse? So this is a warlock here that is going through a backfire because they've been doing spell work or this person could be very abusive. This could be an abusive family member. This could be a Leo that's just heavily abusive. What they words, they lazy, they don't want to work, they don't want to do shit. So this could be this individual going to get into two relationships here so that way they can get some type of inheritance from you. Or they're making it seem like they can they they're gonna build some type of empire here. What's this King of Wands doing in reverse? Page of Swords watching you and spying. What's this Page of Swords with the King of Wands in reverse? The star in reverse. Man, come on, man. <laughs> Hold on. Yeah, my bad, Taurus. <clears throat> so what I'm seeing here is that this individual could be doing like spell work, hoping that you will lose some type of creativity here, or they're hoping that you will be lackluster, or they're hoping that you will like, um, this person is like hoping that you will stop shining. That's what I'm getting. So it's like they watch you all the time, but it's just like you keep shining or you keep uh, persevering. Yeah, you keep getting your wishes met here with the nine of cups. So somebody's being a hater. This is someone that possibly wants to defame you. Yeah, so they keep watching, stalking, and spying to see when they're going to defame you or when they're going, when you're going to run out of like uh your creative abilities or when you're going to stop being a star or, or something. What's the star page of swords? What's the star reverse page of swords? Yeah, ten of wands. I feel like somebody wants to make your work hard for you here. I feel like, yeah, the Ace of Swords, you may know the truth here about this. Somebody wants to make your work hard for you. Or does somebody wants you to really struggle here. But I feel like you keep shining anyway. You keep coming out on top. Yeah, the Page of Pentacles. I'm getting readings or like, yeah, somebody keeps wanting you to start over with the Page of Pentacles. Somebody wants you to start up over in the cycle here or, or do something new. This could be a younger earth sign that's doing this. Somebody's like trying to pay to see when. <sighs> How they can make something so hard for you. They keep doing divination. They keep getting these readings on you to see when you're going to end some type of cycle here. What's the page of pentacles? But I feel like everything is balanced. Yeah, this could be somebody in your own family that's doing this. Whoever this Knight of Wands is. 
they're mad because they're blocked from being in and out your life. So they got to go and resort to do magic because they can't attack you or they may want to attack you. Or this is someone that wants to constantly keep attacking you. My bad, but I did pull some emotional, um, true emotional. So my bad, Taurus. But whoever this King of Cups is, they're feeling like shit because they have a lot of legal issues. This may be like when it comes to div divorce, this person could be married too here as well. Um, a lot of child, uh, yeah, child support, child paternities or criminal paternities, or this person could have did it's like some type of something here. And now they're going through, going to court for this. This person could have left you on red or they could have just, they didn't give you the closure. I feel like you're getting your own closure here. They feeling like shit because they didn't give you any closure. So I feel like this was like a off and on, hot and cold, detached type of relationship here or situationship. Because this person, I feel like you learned this lesson already, okay? With the unemployment in reverse, I feel like you do very well for yourself. This person knows that. I feel like you also know that this is a karmic lesson and you already learned that lesson from the past already. Because remember, I was talking about the temperance energy here. That was a lesson you learned a long time ago. You learned that lesson already. And now this person could be making a wish. Or this wish is to put a GPS on you or something to follow you. This person's like trying to track your every movement here. That's what it seemed like. Give me this King of Wands in reverse. Love, hate, King of Wands. A shame. This person is not guilty. Whoever this warlock is, they don't feel bad about shit that they did. They don't feel bad about putting spell, uh, doing spell work on you. They don't feel bad about nothing. They don't feel bad about being abusive. They don't feel bad about lying. Um, they don't feel like they were wrong at all whatsoever. Give me the King of Wands in reverse. This is a karmic. Yeah, it's a Jezebel, a man. Yeah, thug. Workplace affair. So this is a, a man Jezebel. He have he has the Jezebel spirit. They they fuck a lot. They like to have a lot of women or a, whoever this is like to have a lot of men. Okay, and um they be screwing around, okay? But they don't feel bad. They don't feel guilty about nothing that they do. Give me the King of Wands in reverse. Yep. This person is keeping secrets about all these readings that they're getting on you. I'm seeing secret readings. So, yeah. They could be trying to find out about some type of pregnancy here. Or they're under some type of um, pressure regarding these fake news or fake pregnancies here Whew. yep fucked up and a love child yeah this is someone that's fucked up because they created a love child now they're trying to pretend like they're fake busy like the police ain't watching them or whatever i don't know man this is kind of crazy i'm gonna end it there though Hopefully, you was able to find some messages in here, Taurus. Like I said, again, I apologize for not getting y'all reading out, um, but I'm going to leave it there. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.